Hey, I'm Brent. Today I'm going to show you a great trick you can do to make taping a little bit faster. Now this, this bucket's kind of cool because each side is exactly the same. So you just want to cut a notch at the bottom, the same, just bigger than the tape. All right, so mark that out. Just like that. We're gonna do the same on the other side. Here. And then you want to stay close to the bottom. There's a bit of a hump here, but just take and make a mark there, and a mark there. You can cut that with a knife, but I'm going to use a fine saw. Okay, so you need a fairly good size notch in there because you want to get mud on it, but you don't want it too big. So next step, we're going to run our tape from a ladder, so you want your tape to go the right way. So if you look, there's an indent one way or the other, so when you put it on your wall, you don't want the you don't want the indent that way, you want it against the wall, like this. So. You want to make sure your tape's not too loose. We're going to slide it through the little holes we made. Okay. Hardest part, getting that started. Okay, get this tape on nice, thin down mud, pre-mixed, use all-purpose or tapey mud. Just pour it in. Thank you very much. All you do is carefully pull this out. And that's it. Get a nice coating of mud. If you don't have enough, you're gonna cut the hole a little bit bigger. And if you have too much, you're gonna have to redo it. So that's it. Pretty easy job. Hope you get your taping done fast.